Endo. Real electricity here on the air at the Etihad. Rain, rain, go away. I'm sure the fans are saying to themselves it has been raining for most of the day here at the home of Manchester City. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary box providing expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Manchester City and they take on Arsenal. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Oh, a smart stop. Trying to deliver it accurately. They didn't have too much room to work with, but a long way off target. And City have possession once more. Kovacic, determined defending. Delivering it and dealing with the danger. Foden, can he find someone at the far post? Not all that convincing defensively. Martinelli. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. Kai Havertz. Marcinelli. It's a weighted pass. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Quite the catalogue of great saves. And that the latest one. They've got it now. What can they do? Well, Arsenal will count themselves unlucky not to have taken the lead there because that was a brilliant piece of goalkeeping. What a good save that was. Yes, they just have to make sure they stay defensively compact here. And ball back with Arsenal now. Jack Grealish. And promising stuff from Arsenal. But timely defending when it mattered. Holland. No. Trying his luck. Well, it was straight at the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. Well, those stats aren't great reading, are they? Neither side is playing with any fluency so far, and as a result, we've seen a pretty dull game. It has to get better. Kovacic. In it goes! The opening goal in this contest. Well, let's just take another look at this pass from Haaland. He has so much vision, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. And so it is. The first half story has been written. Well, advantage City after the first 45 minutes, but a long way from being decided. Now, who can he play it to? Foden. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, he certainly had an impact on that first half, scoring that late goal, but I thought his overall contribution was really good, and he got better as the half wore on. An effective challenge. Mm -hmm. 
Mateo Kovacic. Incisive pass. He can't hold on to it. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Decisive in the tackle. And the throw in here. And David Raya has it now. It's with Erdogan. And Kessia. Moving the ball nicely. Trying to carve out the equaliser. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Here it is now. A substitution. Excellent use of advantage from the referee in City's favour. Really getting stuck in. Rice. Here's Alvarez. Plenty of support here. Holland. And now with Kovacic. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. He's in with a chance. Can he find the net? And choosing finesse, he might be wishing he hadn't. Well, it's good vision, but not the skill to match, I'm afraid. Gvardiol. Well, City are almost over the line, but not quite yet. Stuart, interested in your assessment of their performance? Yeah, just about edging it overall. It's been a really tight game, hasn't it? Chances at a premium, and you have to praise their defending in that regard. Just got to see out the final few minutes now. No silly mistakes at the back. The clock is against Arsenal, but what can they pull out of the fire here? Well, a suspect piece of finishing when all is said and done. And he'll be thinking about that for quite some while. That's a tame finish. Holland. Real chance. In it goes to increase their advantage. And will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them? Let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then through on goal, he just goes to power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. And there goes the final whistle. A real sense of feel-good for City fans everywhere. They take the three points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them.